Hey, what's going on, guys? This is a tribute video to M. Hae Jean. She was a prison guard in the North Korean concentration camps, but she defected to South Korea more than 10 years ago, and she now resides in the South Korean capital of Seoul. Okay? And she... One of the things she witnessed when she was a prison guard is she saw uh, two brothers. They were not her brothers, but the prisoners were brothers to each other. And these two brothers got their heads chopped off. They were beheaded. That's how they were executed. Another thing she witnessed was this prison guard qu questioned this prisoner, this female prisoner. He asked her some questions, and he got annoyed with her, and so he lit her on fire. He burned her alive. That is the kind of sick stuff that goes on in these concentration camps. And she said when she was a prison guard, they were trained to not view these prisoners as fully human. They were trained to view them actually as less than dogs. But she said since she came to South Korea, she started to see things differently, and she started to see that these prisoners had um, families, they had feelings, and many of the prisoners, she said, did not know why they were there because the North Korean government never told them why they were there. Okay? If Moon Jae-in becomes president and does not change his policies towards North Korea, this is the kind of stuff he's going to hide. This is the kind of stuff he's going to cover up. And this is the kind of stuff he's not going to mention to the UN, to the South Korean government, to the U.S. government. And he's going to want the U.S. government and the UN to be quiet about it. And this is pretty sick, sadistic stuff that the North Koreans are doing. And we don't need to be quiet about it because it's not going to make things more peaceful. But anyway, I congratulate M. Hey Jean for reporting this, for being honest with this, and props to her for doing that. Hope everybody's doing well. Take care. God bless and bye-bye. Bye-bye.